too dirty. Meg painfully screams as Sophie thwarts her creepy conspiracy to Kate at Queen's funeral. As the two outsiders of the royal family, Sophie Wessex and Meghan Markle share a lot more than Meghan would like to accept. Prince Edward married Sophie when she was 34, she was the only woman from the royal family with a career and her own business. Markle later arrived to marry Prince Harry, who is one of the Queen's first grandsons and closest to the throne. When Meghan first came into the circle of the royal family, Sophie was the first to extend a hand for assistance. However, according to the son's royal family insider, Sophie quickly realized Meghan had her own agenda. She soon knew they wouldn't become the better friends and the Queen's passing makes this even more improbable. One of the main reasons Sophie Wessex has been very well accepted to the royal family and she is even part of the firm now is very simple. She quickly became one of Queen Elizabeth II's favorites, even before she got married to Prince Edward. After they tied the nod, the Queen became a mother figure to Sophie and the Countess soon embraced her life as a royal. Now that King Charles III is taking the throne, he will name Prince Edward the Duke of Edinburgh. This will inevitably make Sophie a royal duchess. In the eyes of the royal family insider, this is a well-deserved promotion for a woman who has remained devoted to the family. But this isn't the case for Meghan Markle, who not only distanced herself from the royal family but did the same for Prince Harry. There is an evident divide between the couple and the rest of the royals right now. As more details of their problematic relationship keep coming forward, we see how Meghan might never be part of that close circle. Sophie Wessex was a possible way into that circle but Meghan refused her. In other news, Prince of Wales, Prince William is reportedly still furious over the way he and Kate Middleton were treated and awaiting apology from Meghan Markle and Prince Harry. The Hollywood gossip, quoting The Telegraph, reported Prince William is still seething over the way he and Kate had been treated. William and Kate are unable to move on until Harry and Meghan at least acknowledge the hurt they have caused, let alone apologize for it, the article reads. The report further says, they feel that Oprah crossed a line and that someone should acknowledge the motives behind it and the pain it caused. According to the Telegraph, William, Harry, Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton struck a truce after the death of Queen Elizabeth and stepped out together to review tributes to the monarch, however, the trust is gone. Although, the past week represented a chance for reconciliation among the Fab Four, a lasting peace remains elusive, it further said.